It's Super Doppler 7 weather. 448, hey, welcome to Thursday. It's been a September sizzle out there. Temperature's been running well above average for the past week or so. And today it's a continuation of the uh, seasonably warm numbers. In fact, close to record highs out there in spots. We are rain free right now around the Albuquerque metro. And statewide, we have just a little cloud cover to track over the southeastern part of New Mexico. Otherwise, it is just a delightfully quiet morning, a lot like yesterday. Now, we've been hitting our morning low temperatures in the 6 37 o'clock time frame about two hours from now. So we'll still drop off a couple more. But here's where we stand currently 45 grants, about 50 Farmington Gallup. Look at Taos in the upper 40s. It's 50 degrees currently in Santa Fe, comfortably cool across the northern mountains in western New Mexico. You look at Albuquerque and then points to the south, it's southeast, and it looks like we're in the 60s to about 70 degrees around Alamogordo and Roswell and Carlsbad this morning. Uh, storm track still off to our north, and this is a storm track that's not really allowing the monsoon to feed much moisture into New Mexico. So this will be another day with very limited afternoon storm coverage. Uh, we're going to watch this cold front right here. Here, just kind of making its way into the west coast. That one will probably get off to our east and then back into New Mexico for Saturday, resulting in some significant changes. But today and tomorrow, basically a continuation of the past couple of afternoons. Now, one thing we'll watch for here, uh, these would be evaporating rain showers around central New Mexico at about the 5 o'clock time period, which could result in some enhanced wind gusts. Right now, any uh, shower coverage would be very, very limited. And uh, we'll watch for another computer model run that will come into our system at about 545 this morning and see if that late Late day sprinkle threat and wind gust threat uh, is a recurring theme. Now we look ahead towards tomorrow, and it does look like drier air will move back into northern New Mexico, and any slight chance that showers will be seen across the far south. Here's a preview of the weekend. Now, Saturday will start off with gusty east winds. They'll turn out of the south and southeast by afternoon. It looks like eastern and southern New Mexico will see the best chances for showers and storms, and will probably be right on the edge of the rain chances in Albuquerque. But look at Saturday's afternoon temperature 80 degrees. That's actually our average high for this time of year. Now, Sunday could still have moisture around early, then it gets pushed back to the south and southeast for the afternoon and evening, and then we'll probably wait until about Tuesday or Wednesday of next week. Uh, by that time, we could be talking about much better rain chances trying to move in. Comfortably warm across our northern mountain cities. Look, it's another round of these upper 70s and low to middle 80s. Just a super pleasant afternoon coming your way. Yesterday in Roswell, we hit 101 degrees. Today's record high in Roswell, that was a record, by the way. Today's record high is 98, and we're forecasting a 97. So, near record warmth, we could hit 100 in Carlsbad, uh, more tolerable upper 80s, lower 90s across the south central and southwest. In Albuquerque, our record high is 91. We're expecting an 88, so it's just a couple out of reach. But we could end up maybe getting close to 90 degrees if the winds just kind of uh, kick up right for us. Uh, it'll be in the low 80s in the East Mountains and around Santa Fe. Another quiet one to enjoy for our Friday. Saturday, there will be a slight chance for storms. Gusty east winds, maybe a leftover shower for Sunday. Not expecting a lot of weekend rain, but I'll tell you what, Tuesday and Wednesday of next week, we could be talking about uh, some soaking rain chances moving back into the state, something we will really need by then. Todd, Marissa. Thank